Good morning from Miami Beach. It's time for Miami vlog number two, so I wanted to explain a little bit if you haven't watched Miami vlog number one, but if you haven't, hello, go and watch it. It's just on my channel. Essentially, my friend Christina and I flew to Miami for her bachelorette. For the Americans, you'll know what that means. For the Brits, a hen do, a hen party. So, so, so excited. But we wanted to beat jet lag and feel amazing so we actually landed like five days before the other girls so that we could really kind of just like do beach workouts do beach walks have amazing acai bowls smoothies coffees and of course some champagne and cocktails and we just had like so much guacamole amazing food like living our best lives feeling it's been like the best retreat ever i am so beyond grateful but now the bachelorette starts so we are very excited there's lots of prep happening i'm gonna pop on screen some of the stuff that i've got christina i got her some bachelorette things which i'm so excited i actually gave her them at the airport to get her excited got her like a little crown and there's just lots going on so we're sadly checking out of this hotel which has been a dream like i think this is one of my top hotels ever i called my boyfriend this morning i was like yep we're coming back we're staying here so i'll give you a quick little brief tour before i leave just so you can see although it's a bit messy right now and we're checking into an airbnb with 10 girls we've got lots organized so i'm really 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 excited i actually had to go and print some stuff this morning i'll put it on screen because i filmed it and it was so funny i'm quiz master and christina wanted some like games and quizzes so i went to the business center downstairs to print it and honestly i printed it wrong I'm sat in the business center after my workout feeling great and I'm like oh my gosh it says brid instead of bride so I had to like remake it reprint it so it's been a morning but honestly they're all printed they look amazing and I'm so excited so I'm gonna put some clothes on we're gonna check out of here and then Christina and I are gonna go for a walk along the boardwalk because the Miami Beach boardwalk is stunning I'm gonna miss this side of town so 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 much and then we're gonna just go down and have a look at some like art deco stuff have some food and then we check in and meet the girls at four I think we're gonna go to Target as well let's see oh it's so pretty here she is the bride to be I was organizing the Airbnb I'm taking her on a sightsee of Miami and we're just on like Ocean Promenade, I think it's called. Ocean Drive, maybe? I don't know, but I'm showing her like the really cute Art Deco places. First stop, Mexican food, because we just haven't eaten enough Mexican food this trip. Honestly, we want to go home feeling like guacamole. This place gets good the reviews. Avocados so. are just so much better here than I know, than back home. finished so all week Christina's been like I just want like dirty tacos like proper tacos like proper street tacos not like posh tacos honestly like the ones that you get like from a like taco like Trump. stand in yeah, yeah, Cabo yeah. at like 2 a.m. that cost like a peso and we found them they were really good and when I'm I googled it happy. said they're the best tacos in Miami yeah and the tortilla chips were quite fluffy which I've never actually I've never had, had tortilla chips like, like that in my life you can tell they obviously were fresh made tortilla oh, chips they were, like, from fresh tortillas chips, yeah. but like yeah, I never had anything like that before. I've really never had anything cool. like that. Yeah, they were fluffy yeah, and I'm crunchy really, and crispy. Really satisfied. So we're very happy. We're now going to walk back down Ocean Drive just to take in a bit of the art decor, and we're just happy, like happy bellies. The... It's just a little bit windy. Hence this, by the way. I was going to say the sun came out. So the sun happy. came out. So yeah, we're very, very happy. Excited when I see anything that looks like it sells candy. We found like a cute little food stall food market i guess this was not here before we got like lemonade and guacamole bowls oh my god guacamole bowls oh yes and now versace christina spotted that a mile off i'm really making her do the tourist things to start the batch before she gets to the airbnb because i don't think we're gonna do any tourist things. no we're not so i'm like i'm gonna show you she's american and she's never been to miami it's like in your own backyard right like, yeah I feel like a lot of Brits haven't gone to certain places in Italy because it's like, oh, it's just right there. Yeah, no, you are right. Looking at, we're looking at the merch shops. 
on Ocean Beach. But they're actually quite cute. Christina needs a white swimsuit because hers didn't arrive. Look at that white and gold one. I kind of like that. Yeah, so we're doing like a white and gold theme and Christina said we all need to wear gold accessories. I mean, these are great. Pink and gold, they're really pretty. Yeah, very Miami. Yeah. They look cute. But you know, my favorite one is the one that you just picked up. Oh, these are so nice and these are $7.99. Okay, that's amazing. Oh my God, they have Prime. Like they literally have Prime. I am so excited about this drink. You could only get it from the vitamin shop. Okay, I think we're gonna need a basket. I am gonna get myself some of this because it's amazing. I'm going to get an orange one and a blue raspberry. We just got out of Target. I'm gonna talk about that in a moment, but can I just say, they had so much Prime in there, and apparently in the UK right now, this is selling for 50 pounds. I'm not about to resell it. I'm about to eat it and drink it. Eat it and drink it, I'm about to drink it. This one is so good. Like when I was in New York, it was so hard to find it. They have it in vitamin shop. And honestly, I have to go to so many stores to find it. And they just had loads. So, cheer. There we go. <laughs> Technical difficulties. People keep messaging me on Instagram being like, how did you find that? And I was like, is that, it was like, there was loads in Target. It was a whole like, section. Oh my gosh, I wish I had more luggage because I would genuinely buy it all when I'm in New York later this week or next week. I am gonna buy as much as I can fill my final 3kg of my case with. Not to sell it, just to drink it. Like, it's really nice. Honestly, leave your Miami stuff with me. I'll take it home. So and just space. take all the brand. Like, I want to fill my fridge with it. So at Target, we bought a Cadbury. Let's do a taste test, see if it tastes different. This is the pre-batch nerves kicking in. We're nervous, oh, you guys, we're excited, you can't even open it. Christina like loves dairy milk. We just did that thing where we were like, we don't like blocking pavements and then just block the pavement. <laughs> Pioli said that we could have dairy we milk. We had a conversation about that like 10 minutes. <laughs> Christina, Christina thinks it's not milky enough. She's like, no, it tastes different, no. That's a placebo. I think if I didn't say anything to you, you wouldn't have realized. I'm gonna Google it. I Googled it. It's something to do with like cocoa butter and fat content and evaporated milk. So you were probably right. But it's still delicious. Like, I'm really oh, no, not mad really about good. it. It's still really well, yummy. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, I'm happy. I'm Say bye bye to the gorgeous pool and on to the next. We do not travel lightly at all. So we just checked out of our gorgeous hotel such a great experience i have to say davis who is the concierge absolutely made our experience like he was amazing in fact all the concierges there were amazing they were so helpful and worked their magic on getting us reservations which you'll see on the last vlog so sad to check out bittersweet but now it's time for our next few days in miami and we are heading to an airbnb we asked davis we we're like is it a good area is are we fine and he said that it was kind of like gentrified like 20 years ago and now it's like really nice and the houses are like two million dollars so very very excited i've seen the airbnb like on pictures christina hasn't so let's go get all the other girls you've got like an international girl gang there also been setting up today well i've been keeping this one busy with good food and snacks and target and now we're gonna get there we're here oh, we're gonna go the there. bride is here okay ready yeah ready yeah okay wow. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on content duty. Yeah. 
on it. <laughs> Go on. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Oh, I love that. Oh, you need to lift that up. Let's have a look at the outside. Oh, this is a lovely bathroom. This is gorgeous. Yeah, to be honest, when I saw the bathroom, I was like, we're, we're getting this Airbnb. I was like, this is the Airbnb for us. Right, we need to look outside. Moment of truth, yes! There we go. This is really cute. <laughs> this is cute, mini girl. It's such a good job. It looks so nice. Oh my gosh, thank you. So you don't hate me. You don't hate me. Look at it all. Look at the snacks. Gosh, they got the Jesus. <gasps> So basically you got all the snacks for me. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, I'm excited. The vlog is strong. Ask for some popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> Tequila! Oh, yeah, good idea. That's probably a good idea. I'm just really excited. Those are really cute. It was weird, Anna. I put tender fish instead of. I know. I'm actually really starting to like embrace it this year. Giving them to Christina with the correct spelling. I miss you. Cheers. It's in here. Eight one eight. Yes, which is amazing. Organic agave next to Oh, lime. Lime, of course. And, that's all. and ginger ale. No, no, no that was this is her. You literally just did agave, tequila, really? and yeah, lime. Oh my goodness, I'm copying that. Thank you. <laughs> that was amazing. Yeah, we got wedding invite. We are all checked in. The Airbnb. You can hear the girls. And now we're getting ready for tonight. The theme is vigiled. And we all got matching dressing gowns. Mine says Sheldon on it somewhere. Wow, here. Yeah. So Sheldon on it, and we all have matching ones. So I need to really quickly change this around. Outfit of the night, please. Gorgeous. Lucky girls, and we are heading to dinner. A very late dinner, so it's gonna be more drinks. To Kiki on the river. But Kiki, we're not actually getting dinner. do you love me? We're heading to appetizers. Yeah, like it's a restaurant, so I think it would well, be like a snack. Maybe we get a dessert. It was all cheese tonight, and she couldn't eat. Right, so we need to eat. Some we food. maybe get like some snacks and some chocolate and some. No, we're gonna like, get some appetizers. Some yeah, some like veggies. We need to get some substance for people.
very vibrant this trip I'm wearing lots of vibrant colors because the theme was colors and neon and vibrancy so that's why I'm so bright but we are going to strawberry moon good morning it's day two of the actual batch <laughs> I should have probably said that last night was really fun we went to a place called Kiki on the river and it's kind of like a Greek restaurant that's just such a vibe. And then we went to a nightclub afterwards, which was actually next door, so it was great. And it was just such fun. Like everyone's like dancing on the tables. Our concierge said the food is gonna be average, but the cocktails are amazing, and the cocktails were amazing. So the girls are all just getting ready, having a little photo shoot. We're all very vibrant, ready to go to Strawberry Moon. Yes. <laughs> Cheers. It's time. Tell, tell the vlog where we're going today, Christina. We are going to Strawberry Moon, which is a pool party, because I don't like clubs. And um, what's the theme? You don't like clubs, but we went to a club last night. No, we went to a restaurant that turned into a club. <laughs> Absolutely had a club in there. Yeah. Um, Show the veil. Today is like Miami Vice. Miami Vice is. I love that. So all the girls are in fun, bright Miami colors. And this dress, we actually got this the other day in Miami in Windward, which is so stunning. It was actually the cutest store, and we met the designer and the manager of the store, and they were just like the biggest hype. It's on vlog number one, so you can see it on there. But no, that's really cute. I love it. So excited to be the. Oh so God. let's drink our rose and then go. Let's work it. Snack queens. <laughs> it's an F you know you know. And these are so good. I was first introduced them in Tahoe. They're amazing. I can go. I can go, I'm ready. Oh, I just can I can go. I'll go whichever card. That's so I care. hotel of the trip the addition it was actually really fun like the vibes and the music was so good we actually didn't want to leave and then as a little treat for christina i organized a private chef tonight so we're gonna get into our robes i'm just gonna put a hoodie on because i'm quite cold and i organized like a mexican party at the airbnb and i'm so excited i found this chef called gina and she's meant to be amazing she got amazing reviews so waiting for her to turn up and then we have a mexican night in the house we're gonna do like quizzes and games and i just think it's gonna be so special just going to put my hoodie on but yeah honestly strawberry moon was really really good like it was just fun it's very aesthetic very pink and green and just very cute and like pastel and all the girls that were so nice like they were taking our pictures i'll put one on screen of us today and it, they just like hyped other girls up and i think it's really important that you like hype other people up and every single girl that was like let me take pictures for you let me hype you up and i love that so yeah popping this on and we're gonna go and have some margaritas and then wait for the chef to arrive our chef is called gina and i'm like you want a strong amazing woman to come cut for a group of incredibly strong women <laughs> More margarita in a picture tonight. Yes. How gorgeous is that? I squeeze that line, baby. She made us a full cocktail. Thank you, Mila. 
Yeah, while I do the rest of the rice and everything, so I just love her because you just seemed friendly and like you had. We also wanted like a strong woman, um, and we love the menu choices. We got the menu looked amazing. These are the biggest avocados I've ever seen in my life. We don't get avocados like this in London. It's kind of sad. Or they're like more, but yeah. here in Miami we have the has ones, the little ones, those are the has, and these are the conventional ones that I use in Colombia. Work of oh, oh, wow. Oh, so excited. Beautiful. No way. So I'm just out here living my best life. Yeah, and how it is baby so we have chocolate. Wow. And it's kind of spicy but savory. Oh nice. Flavor. And this is the kitchen. Wow. I'm gonna mix up with the molly. Wow. Um, those are the vegetables that are gonna be grilled. That's real gonna be amazing. It's a work of art. Look at this. Wow. Hi. <gasps> Look at that rice. It's incredible. Can you do a sample? Will you make a sample one of each so people know what it should look like? I really have put out my thoughts. That's honestly probably a good idea. Yeah. 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 Yeah, look at your pasta. Yeah. I told M once, like months ago, that El Paso is my favorite tacos. She gets a chef to make. She literally delivered. I didn't even realize that she's like registered, but like, come on. Oh, she listens. Thank you so much. Yeah. self-care. I just did a swim, why miss, with this mask, because today we have a really exciting brunch. Oh my gosh, Chef Gina last night was amazing, like 10 out of 10, recommend. Can't take myself seriously with this, but now I'm going to get ready for a beach day. Full cycle, don't mind about I know, I would have loved to have done a soul cycle. <laughs> I might be doing this week, yeah. Yeah, that's all. Like, Say hi. Yay. And you did, so you celebrating in Miami or yeah, hotel, yeah? Exactly. And where are you guys staying? Uh, we rented an Airbnb just across the bridge. Mm, yum. Cheers to Christina. Cheers. So you guys should definitely go to one hotel. They have one in New York, in Brooklyn, and the one in Miami is beautiful. We actually had coffee there earlier this week, but today we went there and we really enjoyed lunch. I mean, the food is huge. We absolutely should have shared. We did not need 
to get individual portions but it was so delicious and just gorgeous vibes perfect bridal as well it's very like laid back luxury and we're all wearing neutral colors today that's kind of a theme we've seen us in some gold and white and we're all kind of in like nudes and white so it works really well so now we're just walking along miami beach we obviously stayed here the first half of our trip and it's so nice to be back on this beach on the beach and our matching outfits. Everyone looks gorgeous. Look how cute they are. We're actually back at our original hotel. All matching in our cute gowns. They just like poured into a bottle. What? Yeah. Oh, how interesting. What a fascinating experience. tortilla soup I've never tried this or heard of it but I'm very excited she left it for us and said if we were hungover to have it <laughs> quiz night quiz night Eva you gotta chug your whole beer she loves the quiz quiz master was that cute Wait, that was really so fun. much fun <laughs> this is the best, this is the best one out of all okay everyone round them up the others were just warm ups you know count them up guys Eva, you got minus six. <laughs> I got minus eight. <laughs> oh. Shimmer. Well, and I'm in the band. They all see you have a man. I can still say I don't remember. Familiarity breeds content. So put me in the basement when I want the penthouse of your heart. Diamonds in my eyes. I polish up real. I polish up real. Nice. <laughs> 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 might be warm. No, it inverted my nipples earlier, no way. <laughs> I think it's warm. Oh. I know, warm. it's not bad. Oh, I know. Mama. It's nice, I was all the way down here and not It's crying. nice out. <laughs> Good morning from Miami. So yesterday we ended up just having like a beach day and a pool day. We went to Soho House. It was so nice. They had like a party on and the sunsets were amazing. So everyone just drank rosé and danced there. Then we actually were going to go to an after party that we were invited to. But ended up just going back to the house, finishing off Chef's Gina, Gina's food, which was insane. We still had so much left in the fridge. And then we just played quizzes and party games. I was so high on life. We were just dancing, singing to Lizzie McGuire and Taylor Swift. It was amazing. So now I have a flight to New York today, hence the no makeup, but just going to go grab some food before we head to New York. So we're going to a place called Little Hat which is apparently really good and very fitting for the little hen that just stood in front of me, Christina, the little hen. 
So that is the plan. We we're gonna go to a place called Swan that came highly recommended, but it was actually closed. We're a little bit too early. And then there's another place that we went past called L Bagels, which is meant to be amazing, but it's a Tuesday. And the only day it's closed is a Tuesday, but hopefully we can get into Little Hen, have some good food, have a little wander around, and then I jump on my flight to New York. Oh, perfect. Thank you so much. I love this called Little Hen. It's so cute. It's very British, actually. <laughs> Thank you. So this is the honey and mint tea and a lavender latte and a coconut cappuccino. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, I got tacos. Oh my god, you're prepared. Thank you. And you guys, take my fries. Christina got an omelette. Natalia got a sandwich. I'm definitely gonna have some fries. You got a salad? I did. Oh, yeah, I made it a little. You're healthy. I got tacos. They look amazing. <laughs> Area has some really nice shops. Everything looks so nice for food. Midtown. It's amazing for pasta as well. Also looks like a really nice spot for brunch, old days. Good morning from New York City. If you follow me, you'll know it's my happiest place in the land. So I'm signing out of Miami now. It was honestly the best week. I have vlog one and two. So thank you so, so, so much if you watched either or if you watched both. If you made it this far, leave a comment and I want you to write either hen party, if you call it a hen party, or bachelorette, if you call it a bachelorette. Or in your country, let me know what you call like the pre-bridal thing. I would love to hear from you. I honestly had the dreamiest trip. The start of The Bachelorette with Christina where we just did like cute girly things was amazing and so calming and then obviously having all the girls in a house and just living our best life like we just had the best 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 time. I actually wish I had longer with all the girls because we became like a family in the end. Ate great food, drank great drinks, the weather was beautiful and I'm just really really grateful. So. Thank you so much if you watched any of my vlogs. Come say hi on Instagram at mchillax and everything is saved on a highlight called hen. Because in Britain, we call it a hen. So, next time I will see you in New York for my New York vlogs. Bye guys.